What's up everybody, Sparrowood again here from Sleepless Nights with another episode on Space Engineers. Uh, when we left off we had been working on the space station with the, well, the gravity. Which was pretty cool, I love how it came out actually. Um, the whole being able to just walk down here and flip and keep on walking. I love that idea. Um, I did get a suggestion though that I talked about going down and like wrap around and doing all this, which I do intend to do, uh, but I also got a suggestion about going up the wall and going all along the ceiling, and I thought, I don't think I've ever seen a space station like that before that uses all of the wall space. Like, floor, wall, ceiling, like, just make it all work. So that's kind of going to be a project of mine. Um, I can't say how much of it I'm going to show on camera. Because it's probably going to be a lot of work and tedium of just tweaking settings and trying to make everything work right. So I don't really think I'll show a lot of that. More just like show back up and be like, hey, look what's done. Um, but last episode we had talked about power. I still haven't gotten this to fire yet. I haven't had a target or ammo. Um, but we talked about power and one of the big things that came into question was that we don't have a good pipeline of materials. Um, I've basically been stripping down some of the ships that I've found, but I haven't been finding ships, so we are actually running out of certain things. So I decided I wanted to build a drilling ship, because I don't have drilling arms for the Honey Badger, and the merge blocks are just being really derpy right now, and they kind of scare me. So, with this lovely SNC and C mod, we can make smaller ships. We saw the little bike that was a test run. So what I'm working on here is a new ship. No title yet. I used the, um, uh, what is it? The heavy seat? I used the heavy seat, and I put about three drills. I want to see what the drills do in relation to how they normally are on a main ship. I also have a micro connector and a battery set up back here. We have a micro gyro up here, so if this works, I mean, we could actually make, like, pretty cool looking ships. And you know what? I think I'm going to change this. I had two spotlights and an ore detector here, but I think I'm going to change... Okay. That's interesting. That's okay. I uh, can't carry those. Alright, well, let's work on thruster placement then. Bit so that we can pick those back up before we do anything. So I want to put one here, and we'll put one on this side, and that'll be like our forward. So we have two forward. I'm not as concerned with back, uh, simply because, well, it's backing up, so, I mean, this is a drilling ship, not a fighter, so we're not going to have to worry about it, like, needing to be super fast. And it's backing up -ery. Although, I could put... What would it look like if I did... That. That's not bad. We'll leave that there, I think. Keep the bottom flush. So we've got two forward, one back. Um, what would these look like on the side? Maybe we can pull that off. We could also put them back here. Make them look like tires. <laughs> That would be kind of funny. Um, actually, hold on. We can use the strip ones for these. I love these thrusters. These are so cool looking. So, so far we have forward, backwards. This will be left and right. So now we need up and down. Up, we could probably... Eh, I don't like that. Uh, what about these? Can we use these? I don't remember if this is... Oh wait, no, it has an arrow as to where it's pointing. So this is down. Okay. I tell you what... Let's do... Hmm. Let's get... Let's remove this. Uh, this is the connector and this is the battery. In case I hadn't made that very clear. And we're also going to need... Did I not include landing gear? I don't think I did. Um, and what about these? I've never actually used these before. 
Yeah, they're... no, nah, I don't like those. Alright, so let's put that there. Um, now we could probably put... this here? That would look kind of weird. I don't like that as much. Um, how about... this one? That works. And then we could actually put a, an invert here and make that up. Okay, that'll work. And then... and then... I do that all the time. Uh, can we put the connector... Wrong way. It's normal. That may be... Sure, that'll work. Um, and... Just for the sake of symmetry, we'll put another landing gear here. Now, can I collect these? Sweet. Alright, so let's put more drills is where I'm going with this. I want it covered so that I can basically just fly straight in to something. Now, how big are the camera blocks for this mod? Actually, fairly large. Now... I wonder if I can do this without... Oh, it's not up to... S okay. So we need to build this. I need displays, another motor... Can't... Ah! Crap. Alright, let's just go ahead and put stuff in here. I don't know what all I need to do all this. I just grabbed a ton of stuff and started, like, putting it in my inventory. So I don't know what all I need. Um, okay, there's that. Alright, so I'm gonna go around and make some... I didn't bump it, did I? Whew, okay. Uh, I'm gonna go around and make some tweaks, and then we'll be back in a minute. Okay, so I've made a few revisions. I don't know why I'm getting such bad frame rate lag all of a sudden. Um, I've added... The... oh no, I have not added. I was intending to add, apparently. The ore detector on top... Okay, gosh, what is going on with my frames? It was fine, and now it's not. It's all I, all I know. Um, and two spotlights. Okay, I'm gonna pause this and see if I can't take it. What is going on? I'll be right back. Okay, hopefully that's a little bit better. Apparently I had a bunch of stuff running in the background that should not have been running in the background. Um, alright. So let's see. These shouldn't be that hard to... What happened to the welding? The welding looks weird. Oh, that one's gonna take some work. Anyways. So, what I did in order to let this recharge, and I... I was going to put a camera on here, but I think we can see pretty good because of the way these are designed and the open cockpitness. I don't know if that's a word, but it is now. So what I'm going to do, the battery is done. Uh, we're going to call the... Mm, that's fine. Uh, let's add Driller for now until we can come up with a name for the ship. On recharge mode... Yeah, that's good. Now, it doesn't have... So what I did was I finished the cockpit, the connector, and the energy battery, and a few other things, like a couple of the drills. But it occurred to me, these things take so long to recharge that what I'm going to do is... We're actually going to um, activate this, get out of here... Let me out! I hate it when it does that. Goodness. Okay. So what I'm actually going to do... Woo! Is, um... I guess it really doesn't matter what direction we're facing. Is, I'm going to use the landing gear... On this one. This should be a fun maneuver. And... I'm going to basically... Grab it is the idea here. Oh, jeez. Okay. Ha! We got him. Alright. Um, oh, crap. This is going to be so hard to f 
fly it. The weight is so weird. Alright. Okay. Um, let's see if we can't drift this thing into the connecting port. Oh, maybe. Maybe. Where is the con Oh, wait, I'm doing this wrong. The connector's this way. No, no, come back. Come back. Ugh, man, this is so hard because of the... Let me see if I can't turn around here. The, the weight is so weird, is the problem. So let me see if I can't readjust and get a better angle. Oh, I didn't even realize they lit up. That's cool. Okay, now let's tip it this way. That's a little better. It's a little easier to fly this way. It's still really hard. Okay. <laughs> this is how to derpily charge your ship 101. Okay. Am I... I'm not anywhere close to this thing. What am I doing over here? Okay, get... Get down. Go... F go out. Nope. Nope. Tip this way. Okay, we're good that way. Let's bring it back. It should be that it should be pretty close. Why is it not locking on? All right, we're not moving. It's po fuel critical. It's possible that I actually need to have this like on. Maybe. Uh, where's connector? Connector, connector, micro connector. It is on. Okay. So, what I'm wondering is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. What I'm wondering is if I have to actually, like... Hmm. I don't know. Have it somehow... I mean, I can't really get much better than that as far as... lining it up. It should have auto-grabbed it, I would have thought, by now. And the fact that it hasn't kind of... makes me not sure what's going on here. Okay, we're not moving. Let's get out. Because the problem is this one, this one doesn't have a reactor or anything. Landing gear's in proximity can't lock it, though. I don't know. I don't know what to make of that. Um, unless I have to build... Uh, having to build a reactor to dock it with something so that it can be connected is just weird. In my opinion. That's kind of funky. I wonder... Let me try this. What happens if we turn the battery... Oh, it's not in charge mode. I was going to say, what happens if we turn that into active mode, but... Huh. Hmm. It's got to have power. That's the only thing I can think of as to why that wouldn't work, is that it needs power. But I don't know how you're supposed to get it power when it won't... Um, connect. So I guess we're gonna have to make a temporary reactor, which really, really sucks. I didn't want to have to do that. But, oh well. What are you gonna do? Alright, so I'm gonna build this, get this thing docked, and then we'll finish it up, I think. Okay, so it is officially done. Everything is welded together. I did add some micro storage blocks to the back. Um, I don't know if they actually store anything or not. I don't have, like, connectors or anything set up to them. I just kind of stuck them in here. Um, so, I mean, this isn't the most efficient design, but I'm, I was working to get a smaller ship that would do more 
to try and replace the Badger, because it's really bulky and doesn't drill very well. So, let's take this baby for a test run. Um, I did get an antenna on the back, right above the connector. I don't know if you can see that or not. Um, and I've got the 1, 2, and 3 set up to where 1 is our drills, uh, 2 is the ore detector's toggle of on and off, and 3 is whether the battery is in recharge mode. So now it is not. Now it is. Um, let's see, just for kicks and giggles, what our battery is actually at. So stored power, we're at 260 kilowatts, or, or however you say that, kilowatts per hour. Um, and we would take 20 minutes. I've had it on the charger for like 10 while I was building the rest of this. Um, so let's go ahead and uh, turn it on. And then we'll undock. And then we'll fly away. Oh my gosh, let go. Before it wouldn't grab me and now it won't let go. And I got to admit, the one micro gyro seems to be enough. Like, we're not doing too... It's a little floaty that we could add another one somewhere. Uh, let's turn our ore detector on. I could really use nickel. Is probably the thing that I'm looking for the most right now. Uranium, cobalt, gold, magnesium, iron... Any nickel. Platinum. Nickel. There you are. Where are you? Where? Where are you? There you are. Alright, so is this nickel, or... I think it is. Maybe. Alright, so let's turn these on. Hi. So we still have a mass issue. In terms of the, uh... Um, the torque. We're kind of getting pulled everywhere. Woo! I'm not entirely sure it's a bad thing, though. We could cover a lot of ground and get a lot done. Woo! Alright. Um, let's just check out and see... Stop moving first. How these drills do. Wow. Okay, so they're already maxed. Whoa. I guess that's why they're smaller drills. Now the... Where's the... Oh, so it is pumping into the cargo containers. Okay. Wow. Now there's no conveyor system, my bad. Uh, that's the only other thing is we would have to manually... Um actually access each individual thing, which probably isn't the most optimal solution to this problem. Um, oh, you know what? I could put more here, but that's a problem for another time. Um, actually, is there connectors in this mod pack? I think there is. And they're small, if I remember correctly. Leg guard structure. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Grinder, welder, driller, control panel. I'm. <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> uh, the connectors are right here. Because we have connectors. <laughs> um, the only thing I don't see is conveyor tubes and conveyor belts. So I don't know if that'll be added in later. It probably will, if it's not already and I'm just overlooking it, which is also a possibility. Uh, grinder... Yeah, so I don't see one. And if I try and do any, any more with this, I'm just gonna overload the thing. So we don't want to do that. And I'll tell you what, I'm actually going to park this guy like here and the reason for that is that I ultimately want to end up moving most of my stuff out from the whoop that's a good park <laughs> look at that park job just can't beat it 
can't beat it. Um, why would you shut up about the f ship fuel? No one cares. Uh, okay, let's roll this down. There we go. Um, so yeah, we're actually doing... I love these little ships, though, because they use so... F oh, that would have been funny, falling and get thrown out that way. Um, they use so little power, even like that with, with the drills and everything. I think it said we had like 44 days idle, we had 13 hours of drill time, and we only let it sit on the charger for like 10 minutes. Um, so they're pretty awesome little boogers. I really enjoy these small ships, and they're, well, small. So they take up very little space, like I think that's like a block. Or something. I mean, it's awesome that we've made a drill ship with within a block's worth of space. It's pretty cool. Um, I don't see connectors, however, in this mod, which could prove problematic if that's true in terms of unloading the stuff. Um, so I'm not really sure how to address that yet. That's something that I think we'll get into in the future, but I wanted to have a better alternative to the um, the Badger, which arguably this may not be a better one because it would take more time to get stuff in and out, but it's faster in terms of charging it, drilling, and stuff like that. So I, I don't know. I don't know. It may be a catch-22 where One's smaller, more compact, and faster, and less bulky, but it's harder to unload everything. You know, it's it's very possible, but I think with the amount that we can carry in here, I should be able to unload it rather easily, I think. I mean, we actually got a lot of ore there. I mean, it's, it's kind of misleading, but we're actually... we actually did a really good job on that in terms of what we actually got off of it. I mean, that's 3,000 nickel right now. Um, the other thing I wanted to look at is uh, next time, hopefully I'll either get into or we'll have already built um, a different... Rea not a reactor, refinery. I'm thinking out of the mod packs, I'm thinking of this one in here. This one. Uh, Material-wise, I think it's the same thing. Uh, 10, 10, 10, 30, and 8, 10, 80. And this one is... That's assembler. That's... Oh! So this actually is easier to build. Okay. Um, but it's the new refinery. Uh, it, it, anyways, it looks really cool. I want to use up my mods. Like, I don't want to just have a bunch of mods and then not have anything. Um, so yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, and I will see you all next time, I guess. Peace!